Now, speaking of Reese Walsh, he has just re-signed, as we hit record, a $5.5 million extension with the Brisbane Broncos for five seasons. I think I know what you're going to say, Terry, but I'm going to throw to you. What are your opinions? Is he overpaid, underpaid? They got this right, or have they jumped too soon? Um, look, he is arguably before he got before the weekend. He was arguably the form player of the competition, and you know, very very soon he's going to be the Australian fullback. He'll be the Queensland fullback for the next decade. He is so good. Like, and you saw the talent when he went over to the Warriors. You just saw that there was all this untapped potential. And he, he shone at the Warriors. Like, make no mistake about it. He didn't just come back to Brisbane and get good. Like, he was brilliant over there. He is sensational now. And I think the Broncos have paid probably, I reckon, below market value for yeah. him. Because if you go to the Titans, if you went to the Dragons, if you went to the Bulldogs, uh, and so many of these other desperate clubs and said, how much would you be preparing for Reese Walsh? I think you'd be saying they'd be preparing 6.5 over five years. Um, so, I no, I think the Broncos have acted smart. They've acted quick. And they got it done. It shows that their their future, what they see him as their future. But not only that, you and I were discussing, they've got Reese Walsh, Ezra Mam, Pat Carrigan, and Payne Haas until 2028 at least. And there are two more until 2029. I think it might be Mam and Walsh. So that's fantastic for the Broncos. They have got a foundation to build for the next decade. And you can tell that not only do they want to be challenging Penrith for the top honours, but they want to be up and around there and winning those premierships. Yeah, completely fair. I can't see anything negative in this. I saw some people immediately, oh, he's overpaid. In what world? He's getting, what, $1.1 million a season? Yeah. That, that's the market rate right now for a superstar fullback. And when it comes to superstar fullbacks, he's in the top echelon. I know he's young. I know he's got a suspension in him. I know he's done some dumb stuff. Every football will worth a grain of salt. Done something dumb. Andrew Johns, Andrew Johns, and Darren Lockyer, Andrew Johns. Like, right, come on, people. One point one million dollars. I think they got a bargain. And to get it done before, and I know he didn't want to leave, but before someone like the Bulldogs said, "Do you want to be the highest paid player in rugby league? Come play for us." One point five, one point six. So, so Reese Walsh will be twenty seven when his contract ends with the Broncos. He's hitting his prime. That's his. That's that's the peak of his powers. He'll be. I reckon he'll be the first two million dollar player in rugby league. He he very well could, and if he plays all the way through, he could play three hundred plus games for Brisbane. I know he played what twenty or eighteen or something for the Warriors, twenty four or something like that. But he he's Brisbane through and through. I mean, for the next five years, you never know what's going to happen. So everything could change next weekend. But this isn't a bloke who looks like he's going to sign and then next year he's going to go. Actually, I want out. He just lives and breathes Brisbane. And the only reason he left them is he wanted to establish himself and come back and play for it, which he did, and he pushed his way out. I, I love it. Yeah, I, I think he's I think he's great. He played he played a little more games than he gave him credit for for the Warriors. But, yeah, he uh, I, I think it's, it's, it's a fantastic move for Walsh, and it shows that this may not be a money move. And I think it's a fantastic uh, move from the Broncos because getting him at – you know, maybe two or three hundred grand a year cheaper than what they could have if they let it go a little bit longer, means they could probably wrap up another play here or there, or or bring in an external player. You're exactly right. They're they're very very well set up. Mm-hmm. A couple of years back, they came last, and we were saying, oh geez, the evolution. Evolution. Like, uh oh, the evolution yeah. is on. Oh, it's fantastic. 